Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, man? It's your main man, Content Kirk. Right there, we got who? Dietrich. Got Mr. Dietrich, followed by yours truly. Papa Ringer shirt. There you go, Papa Ringer shirt. Rudolph right now, hyphen bake. Papa Ringer. Okay, I like that. Papa Wrinkle. Wrinkle Dinkle. Yeah, man, we got some good information for you guys tonight, man. It's about are are people ready? You think people ready for the new world order? There's a lot of things taking place. Everybody need to pay attention. But before we get started, we're gonna come in with that intro. now we want to know we want to we want to ask everybody a question man we're gonna start off like this why are people worried about inflation what you think about that fellas are, are they really worrying about it I I said, are they really worrying the about it you know most people ain't they, I don't think most most ain't paying they, they they see the high prices but they don't know what's going on mm. you, you like to elaborate yeah. on that you know, you know, um, I guess when I was younger, mm -hmm. I was, you know, living, I thought I know what was going on in the world, but I ain't know nothing about what was happening in the world. And most of us right. don't know nothing what's happening. We don't know. Right. Just like they don't know this, the new world order. They don't know that the, the um, XRP and the crypto is going to be the, the future. A lot of people don't even know that. All they see is this person got slick for some money, so I don't want to talk about that. Right. That's right. what he. That's what Murray just said. They ain't really worrying about it. Huh. I'm saying. Huh. I never so, know so nothing I, about. Oh, go ahead, Mo. No, you got it. <laughs> you got it. Huh? Go. Go ahead and finish up. Oh go yeah. Finish. No, I done slipped my mind. Now you go ahead. I get it back. Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> oh yeah, my hey. Nah, with, with with inflation, I mean, I would say people they know something's going on, right? Because your salary is no longer is enough for you to really survive like you like you did a year ago, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you got eggs going up damn near a dollar now. You know, we got gas rising and falling. You know, it's just um, supply for, for wood, uh, food for damn cereal, everything going up. But that pay stand the same, right. which is always, that's just how it is over here, you know? And, but because of inflation, you know, they call it supply and demand, you know, oh, because it costs right. more to ship these things from over here. It costs more to make this. So we got to charge a little bit more to get to it. You know, so, right. I mean, you know, a lot, a lot of shit with the company I'm with. I mean, we, wow. we hey, man, we lost a lot of business. Lost a lot of business. We had to, we had to cut we had to cut one of our source because we don't receiving enough trellis to, to pay the salary for the people that come in earlier. So with this, yeah, man, yeah. yeah. So what are the people going to do now? The ones that wow, to find a new job, right? Dang, but it's a lot of people out here that don't even want to work, and it's work. <laughs> Wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's a lot of people ain't trying to work. How they surviving? I don't know about that one, you know, but I guess they surviving. There ain't nobody going to work. But you know, within with inflation, like the um piggyback off of what um Dietrich said, with in, with inflation, a lot of people see the prices going up, but they don't know the value of the dollar actually going down. Because mm. they printing up so much money. They constantly printing, printing, yeah. printing, and just driving the price of the dollar down into the dirt. You know, just like you say, you paying probably ten dollars, fifteen dollars for a dozen eggs now. You know, just but, gonna keep getting but, worse. But but like y'all just say, some people don't even much realize that's happening. You know what I'm saying? Some mm -hmm. people don't realize well, no, inflation. Right. They don't realize that the dollar's shrinking. That they don't realize that you're going to pay $15 for a dozen of eggs. They don't realize that. Right. You know, that's how I was back then. I didn't realize this stuff was going on 
because I didn't know nothing about it. But now since I study right. and I know stuff, it's kind of scary what's going on. You right. know what I'm saying? All of so, the different stuff was happening. So I'm going to ask you guys a question. Maybe you could tell me or enlighten me on this. How if how would an average person all be able to offset this inflation that's going on now? Well, it's, it's a couple of ways where, where, where someone can go to do it, actually. Um, okay. yeah, get roommates. <laughs> Get get someone to help you <laughs> if you live by yourself. Or, yeah, you yeah, get, your, get your some roommates. That's real. Hey, that's for real. Hey, get get grow grow your own food. Yeah, I could go with that. Your, yeah, 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 yeah. Get your God. You got to go back to that, man. A lot of people, get, a lot of people got lazy, man. They don't want to do that. Yeah. Change your lifestyle. Change yeah. your lifestyle. Mm. Yeah, we just watched Change uh, Lifestyle. Tawan, right? Tawan, Tawan, yeah, Tawan Hodges. Yeah, talking about he budgeting. just talking about budgeting. He just was talking about that, about budgeting right. where you, you know, where your money went at. This man say he making ten grand a month. Where the money? Right. He don't know. <laughs> at the end of the month, he's struggling to get through the end of the month. He say the bills right. ain't all that, but it's where's the money and where the money was at. In the fast food restaurant, coming to see me, pop a wrinkle shirt at the barbecue stand. <laughs> that's where that money at, at the barbecue stand and all that. But that's all good because I'm going to treat the people good and make them all right. That's all they love okay, me. So, okay, man. okay. I'm going to make sure they're good. But that's where the money at, at the fast food, mm -hmm. at the clothing store, you know, all of that. Something you don't need because I know my closet got a yeah. lot of clothes in it. I don't even wear it. But I'm gonna go over here and buy something else. But check this out, though. I don't know if this ever crossed your mind. If you, um, if you thought about it, the U.S. burned millions of dollars. Yeah, right. You know, they say old money and new money. Huh. They take right. the old money and they burn it. We print money. They print money daily, right? So if you can print money right. when you want to print it, we just sent over fifty-five billion to Ukraine. So what is it about? If you can print it whenever you want. You know what? We're gonna jump straight to that. Boom. <laughs> right. So 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 what he's just saying is when they had the dollar bill, they was printing when they want to. Now you got digital, all you gotta do a mash a button. It's the same. They're gonna do the same thing. Same. It's, it's gonna be the same. It just ain't dollar bill. It's easier to do it now with the button smash. This is now this this is from a fat check. When I heard about that on um, what they were doing, I had just went to fatcheck.com to see if it was true or not. So it says um okay. in total about 113.1 billion in funding for in 2022. Um according to the analysis, so this how this how that money was broken down. 67.1 billion was for defense spending. Um six billion. Um, hold on, just didn't say the other 46 billion, including 26.9 billion was for economic support, 7.9 billion for international disaster assistance, 6.6 .6 billion in assistance for refugee, 1.5 for assistance for Europe, um, Eurasia and Central Asia, plus an, another 3.1 billion of the non spending. So they send money over there for defense, economic support. Um, disaster assistance, assistance for disease, and um, and other non-defense spending. One hundred thirteen billion. Now, yes. mind you, the U.S. the U.S. have a deficit of. Um, I got like I looked it up. I ain't finna give you the figure real quick. If it, you, you, Kurt, you might know what approximately what our deficit is. The trillion. It's in the trillions. It's like what twenty. I know it's in the trillions. I don't, don't want to say anything. It's in the trillions though. What fifty one trillion? Yep, fifty one, right? Somewhere oh, up in there. Look it up. I know it's somewhere. Hold on, hold on, nah. One trillion? <laughs> yeah, I'm with the what Dietrich said, man. I got, I can't believe that amount. That's a lot. <laughs> That's a lot. All right, what? listen, we gonna get to it. Get to it, Mo. <laughs> That's a lot, man. I wouldn't they spend that money when war time. So you mean to tell me within the last couple of years we done 
printed more money than we printed in the whole existence of America. What, what did he say? How much he said it was? But I don't hear you. Thirty-one trillion five hundred eighty-one million six hundred. Thirty-one trillion. Yeah. Five hundred eighty-one yeah. million. What? Six hundred thirty-three thousand. Yeah. Yeah, 31 yeah. trillion. It might be more than that. That's why I say 51 trillion. I'm kind of up my mind the ballpark. Watch this, Murray. Is there any sense on that? <laughs> <laughs> 26 is any cents. sense at the end? Or nah, 23 that, cents? That, 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 okay. that sense revolving. That sense revolving. But yeah, though, man. So um, we in debt. But 31 trillion. We got yeah, homeless. But they taking care of their people. Ukraine is down Who with the United people? States. You see? And so, Ukraine, so what, they was over um uh, what her name? Lagar? Chris Lagar. She with the central okay. banks over there. They was over there in Ukraine talking to people in Ukraine. I'm talking about the war was going. It wasn't nobody there. But they was over there talking to somebody about central bank digital currency. I was, I, was, I was going back to the whole inflation thing here, yeah. but it, it, it's no, just go crazy. Go back. It's go crazy. Back. Go, back. go back. Go back. Yeah, go ahead. No, I, see, I will say the way you can offset, in my opinion, uh -huh. is again how we're spending our money. Right. You know, if if, if we if we stop worrying about buying these damn expensive ass foreign cars, jewelry, high right. price clothes. Three, four hundred dollar shoes. Yeah, it, it, it'll change. If we, if, we, if, we, if we stop hitting the malls, if we stop hitting the malls, I mean, we could we could find ways to hit them to, to get their attention to make them, you know what I'm saying? Think it, but it won't happen though. It, it's too many that's just gone, man. It's just materialistic. Gone. Yeah, they gone. ain't nobody. They ain't think about that. Brother just told me he won't do crypto because they lost money. What? That didn't make sense to me, bro. Who lost money? Shaq and Ooh. Serena and the football quarterback. I was like, bro, they lost money or they got paid to tell you they lost money. Cause they ain't, movie stars don't don't loot, don't do nothing for free. They ain't doing nothing for free. Uh charity event ain't nothing for free, bro. They got paid to tell the world that they lost their money because they ain't want no more retail investors. Cut and dry. I'm just speculating. Speculating, <laughs> right? <laughs> speculating. This just ain't you need to go. Yeah, you need to go do your own research. But I'm just speculating that. But that's really what I feel on speculation. Yeah. If if if, if mm. America brought back, if America if America brought back most of our, most of the business over, prime example. So we okay. have a bill. That, that the federal government have and it says for infrastructure like bridges and highways will not the material will have to be u.s from the u.s the issue right. that they're having now is everything that we get comes from china so they can't get it because it's from china but we need it here to make to build our bridges makes no sense right wow. yeah but don't makes we got the sense. people here that know how to build well i'm saying why did why did why did the people from america go to school to farm and to build if they can't, they ain't got no job. All the jobs going yeah, over course. there. You know, all these farmers was here, just like they had all that China. milk. They gave all the milk away. Throw all the milk what out you, in the garden. Hey, what you said, Dietrich? China, huh? Number one, boom, China. Boom. Right. See, see what it led me into? <laughs> see what that led me to? Right, right. The sleeping dragon has finally awoke. Right, China. Hey, you know China. China they gonna do? Well, I guess what we work for China. Man, twenty <laughs> years ago, man. Look, man, twenty years ago, one nobody worrying about China, man. Exactly. Now, I'm saying, what do do we work for China? Oh, you got they got you on notice Pretty now. Much. Oh, you yeah, I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm just saying. When they when they're controlling ports in Jamaica. When they're buying up yep, companies Bahamas, and owning land South in Africa. Africa, yeah, yep. they own they own they have over eight hundred thirty some thousand acres in America that they own, like eight hundred thirty six thousand rough estimate of acres in America. You know, they're not the leading, yep. but they're up there. Yep. 
at West Coast. You gotta pay attention, man. Yeah. Yeah. And, 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 <laughs> but I, and, and so what China what China what China's been doing because the US mm-hmm. owed them so much money. Right. Because the US right. owed China so much money. Right. And, and China's like like you said, they, they got deals in fucking like Jamaica. Um the Korea the, uh, pretty much probably all the damn Caribbeans. South Africa. You know, they over there building over there. Control them. Control you know, them not, ports, and man. Not, not, yep. But see what what they but they doing what America do though. They go and they and they contract them with a figure that they really can't pay, you know. You know, like mm. the, the um so they always go be indebted to them or China is always gonna own pretty much like their raw material, if there's any raw material over there or, or any of their top areas, China's always China gonna be right there with it. But what they got going on now with Pakistan, hmm. <laughs> That might what not, China that got might going not on with Pakistan? Well with us. They, they, they. What they, they got going they, on with Pakistan? If the Pakistan? contract go through, they um, right. they got a, they got, a, they got a plan with Pakistan. Well, I think if if Pakistan agrees to go through with it, is it, it, they going to be indebted to China for ninety billion dollars? And what they supposed but, to be? What China supposed to be doing for them? Just, what China is, is they going to create a China over there in Pakistan? <laughs> they're going to go up north <laughs> and, and create China. They're going, they're going to have these shops. They're going to have their shops, their businesses, their communities. And China, I mean, Pakistan is going to be China. They're going to be, going to be China. So that's, that's that, so, that might be a spot where, where the U.S. Is, may have to, you know, kind of back on the body or not. Wow. But is Pakistan wow. going to do that or that just in the air? Uh, it, it, it's in, it, it's looking good. It's looking. I mean, based on what, what I'm saying, what I read or whatever, it, it's right. pretty promising. It's going. Like I said, they they already they're already there with their businesses mm-hmm. and shops and things set up. You know, the, right. the, the Pakistanis already they they're, they're good with them. So I mean, it's it's more more than likely it's it, it, it get there. And it's crazy though because like it, the school system that we have here, right? You see, right? The Chinese workers, well, I won't say workers, but the people they come over here to get the education and they go back home, uh-huh. or if they stay right. here, I guess you can say it's a monopoly if you want. Every nail shop, eyebrows, they got it, no matter what. Right. It, it, could, it could be the it could be the most ghetto as black as area you want to go to. If you need a nail shop, who will be running it? Yeah, Damn, that's because our people Asian. don't, you know, our people ain't trying to do nothing, man. Chinese come, they're ready to work. They going to work. Our people want a handout. Everything, give me this, give me that. I can't remember who I was trying to show them how to do crypto. They say, you got some. Won't you just give me some of yours? What? Then I went back to the thing of, you could give a man a fish and he can eat for the day, but teach him how to fish and he can eat forever. Yeah. That's all I was trying to and, tell and, him. And, and, hey, hell, even with that, what you're saying, so China is moving around to these different areas and contracting with different people because they ain't teaching them how to fish. Yeah, they, they going over there to say, "Don't sit right here. I'm gonna get everything for you," or go out right, there with that yeah. net and just, and just bring it back. Just take this net. I don't want to. I don't want you to get a fishing pole and bring you back one. Take this net out there. And scoop Come up with hundreds. Of, <laughs> yeah, China, China, China doing it, man. And and with them Russia linking up and possibly they NWO. Wow. Yeah, they NWO. say this is World War Three, right? N-W- now. They say we already N-W-O. in it. NWO. New World Cause, War. Because Russia and Ukraine, <laughs> Russia and Ukraine fighting, we might well be with them because we supplying Ukraine with all of the, whatever they need. Yeah. No. Everything, everything got set except for the manpower. But mm. there's some undercover United States soldiers over there too. Don't tell me they ain't sharpshooters. You know, United States always want to ride with something. Can I go along? You know what I'm saying? They always want to tag along and test them, set it up. Damn, my you bad. Well, they gonna be the muscle. My shirt, wrinkle. my shirt wrinkle too, Rudolph. My bad, oh yeah, man. this is the Papa Wrinkle <laughs> shirt <laughs> show. Everybody shirt should be wrinkled. <laughs> Sure. I don't know wrinkled, Kurt's shirt wrinkle over there. Let me look. Yeah, hey, it's me wrinkle. Hold on, okay. Hold on. Yeah, it's wrinkle. Okay. Yeah, everybody's <laughs> shirt supposed to be wrinkle on this show. 
Shoot, this is Papa Ringo shirt show. <laughs> I remember my nephew got up to go to work. Old Christian got up to go to school one morning. I was like, man, why your shirt so wrinkled? Let's just say, he's just trying to be like his uncle. He wearing his Papa Ringo shirt. <laughs> well, that shirt, like he got it from the bottom of the draw. You know, hey, oh, bro. Lord. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Watch this. Me yeah. Meanwhile, why why China, the sleeping dragon has awakened. There's other things that's going on also. Like this. What was that? What was it? What's that? Hold on. Yeah. They're oh, being yeah. bought up right now. Yeah, because all the new constructions. They don't mm. want nobody to have a house, right? They want they don't want nobody buying nope. houses. They want you to rent everything. Basically, you're coming toward you'll, you'll be what? <laughs> right there, you'll be happy. That's right. They're going to the um basic, what is it? Universal basic income. That's what that's yes. leading to. The universal basic income. Yeah, everything about the them all up. And now you can't to... go in there trying to get the, the average person can't go in there trying to get a loan because mm -hmm. you're not going to qualify most of the time now, you know, but the big companies are coming up. You're going to try to buy that same house that you'd have bought for 220,000, 230,000. Now companies like BlackRock coming in and saying, you know, we're going to pay top dollar. Yep. We're going to build a whole community and we'll pay 300, 350,000 per home, you know, because guess what? They're just going to put in their portfolio because it's going to be rented out anyway. And they're not like me and you. We're looking mm -hmm. for like the next 10 to 15 years of investments or 20 years of investments. They're looking for the life of the company or the corporation. So you're talking about hundreds and hundreds of years down the line. These homes will be constantly generating income, rotating income, and the yep. prices of rent is just going to keep going up. Yep. But you're going to be happy because they're going to have you all on the subscription <laughs> plan. Everything's coming out you automatic. So you're not going to notice yep. it. Hey, guess what? My, my, my rent comes out. I pay $1,900 a month. I don't care. Oh, I pay $50 for my cell phone bill. It comes out automatically. My light bill comes out automatically. I don't have no stress, no worries. It just comes out automatically. Guess what? You're stuck, man. You're stuck. You're trapped. The minute they cut you off, you out of gas. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, wait for that day when they come, when they go to the grocery store and they already have a box ready for them. Here you go. This yours for the month. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, what are you it's all going for? back. You said yeah. they have a box, a, a box, a box <laughs> for, your, for your house over there. They they know the people live in your house. Yeah, mm -hmm. they they go have everything for you. This is your supply for the month or for two so weeks. Would they have to? Would they have to work for that box? Nope. Nah, it's not a you big. Ain't got to work. The universal income plan. Nah. Yeah, that's so another saying, version of wait, Section Eight. Hold on, hold on, man. So you saying they're taking us back to the block cheese days? When you yeah, get yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Remember that? <laughs> That's what they taking you back to, bro. Hey, but yeah, we're hey. going to that block cheese, man. Yeah, we're going back. Block cheese, your milk, everything's gonna be ready for you in that box, right? <laughs> hey, you gotta get yeah. that you gotta get that chicken coop. But they say <laughs> only a few people gonna be working. You know? What the essential? They got you used to that word, the essential. Only the essential people gonna be working. People who ever could get to work. Right. And basically, they're going to let you do what you've been doing all the time, begging. Mm. You know, a lot of people just beg. Ain't never working. And they never go around begging. So now they finna give you a house. They finna give you um, food in a box. They finna give you all this. So you don't really got to beg. Wow. You're still going to beg. Because beg is like begging. <laughs> That's all. That's what they. That's what they like. They say all oh, these people here ain't trying to do nothing real. They want to beg. Let's wow. set them up. Let's set them up. Wow. Now, how long they've been working on this? Since the food stamps. You see, huh. I think food stamps were like one of the first digital currencies. Well, <laughs> digital. It's a currency too, cause you can buy food with it and stuff. You talking about with the card. Not with the paper, yeah, with the, the, color, with the, the paper paper. dollars, with the paper, the monopoly money. <laughs> From there, they went to the digital card. I ate them brown ones and them um, blue fives. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all they ain't had no hundred. I don't think they had a 50. 
It was a 50? I think it was 50s and 20s. I'm thinking. They had 20s. I ain't used to get them. So, you know what I'm saying? Back then, I ain't. Yeah. Yeah. Hur- Hurricane Andrew. We, we went and got them when Hurricane Andrew came. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I don't even know if I was here when Andrew came. I might have been up the road somewhere. But, man, that's crazy. What year was Andrew? I don't know. Mm. 91, 89? Hold on, let me see. Yeah, I, that was 91. I was out of road. I was out of town. Yeah. <clears throat> I was in old Kentucky then. Kentucky Wildcats. Now, just like <laughs> just like um we were talking about earlier, right? How the hedge funds directly buy um the buy funds from, from companies, from building companies, right here. BlackRock is invested in several programs that are providing financing to build new homes to add to the US housing supply. Mm. Now, why is that? And why is that important? BlackRock, BlackRock saying they're doing the U.S. basically a service. We're going to add this to your portfolio so you guys will be able to tax X amount of homes and make money off of them. But BlackRock also, they're going to be leasing a lot of these homes out, like we were talking about earlier. Mm-hmm. I know in, in my neighborhood up here in Central Florida, they bought a whole neighborhood, man. Damn. The whole a whole neighbor one whole neighborhood about like twenty blocks twenty or thirty blocks. I think close somewhere close by here, but it's over there by seventy five. I'm talking about you got miles and miles and miles of brand new houses they just building. I'm talking about now it wasn't nothing on that property, but it's miles. I'm talking about acres and acres. I think it's an Amazon out there. It's all type of stuff out there. Warehouses, a bunch of I mean, apartments, homes. All in this brand new area. Now watch this. These homes are getting built right in the middle of a recession, right? When inflation is when inflation is high. So who's buying these homes? I guess BlackRock. (laughs) (laughs) I guess BlackRock. That's what I was saying. It's a recession. Uh huh. It's a recession. Things going bad. Who right. I was saying that who building just like in my neighborhood here when I first moved here, wasn't that many houses here. Not right. everything being built. Every time you see it, they building something, they building, they building. All these but people, people get laid off, and then people Everybody. can't really afford it because you got a brand new house here, a brand new one now, and another brand new one, then a couple of brand new ones across the street. But the people move in and stay like a month or two, and then they moved out. But you see what's happening also. Companies are laying off people by the thousands, closing yeah. doors on places, right? And yeah. they're building more apartments and more homes. What yep. I'm saying is they getting them ready for the future, right? Okay. All these houses with the universal basic income, we need that because we got a whole bunch of people we got to house. So now we're going to start building and buying it all up. Why they distracted on other stuff? Because there's a lot of distractions out here. Right. You know what I'm saying? There's even distractions in the crypto. If you could just piece through and see what you what 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 you're working with, but it's not so much as the fact of they laying people off. Because right. the last thing I heard was we had like I think it was four million or three million jobs out there. Right. Right. Nobody didn't want them. They said they're gonna give it 90 days. If them jobs ain't took, we're gonna dis we gonna dismantle them jobs for the future. <laughs> them jobs won't be there no more. Because we got them sitting here. Nobody right. won't come get them, so we're gonna eliminate them. When was that? A couple of months ago. A couple of months ago. They eliminating them because wow. nobody don't want them. All right. What do you want? Government jobs. Whatever I don't know exactly what type of jobs it was, but it was like four million out there. Nobody didn't want them. And then they were saying, I don't know if you remember, they were saying by 2025, maybe half of Americans won't have a job. So what you're telling me, we can't see these numbers, right? Right. <laughs> we can't see these numbers. They're saying that so many four million or whatever jobs are available, right? Right. And right. If people don't come, we're gonna eliminate them. Right. We don't know if they offer these jobs to people or not. 
But right. we do know they have artificial intelligence taking over a lot of these jobs. So is that just an excuse to slap artificial intelligence in there? Say, hey, we or did maybe, offer the jobs to 4 million people. Nobody took them, so. But yeah, but like, look, now, I see here. It's a lot of people ain't working, bro. Yeah, it's got to be all, everywhere. They right. not working. Even when I was at Cracker Barrel, I trained so many people, bro. They would come to work for a week or two and they gone. Hmm. Where they at? Well, I'm, I'm just saying. I see this dude who come to my barbecue spot. He got a new job every day. Oh, I just got another <laughs> job, bro. I was like, where are you working at now? Oh, I'm over here at this place here, man. <laughs> every day he come with a new one. I don't know who I was telling you, Murray. I don't know if I was telling you. I don't ever tell somebody that I could go get five jobs tomorrow morning. Right. That's how easy it is to get a job. If I want a right. job, I could go get five jobs tomorrow morning. Right. And that's what I know I could do that. Wow. So, yeah, because the job's right there. Even much Cracker Barrel asked me that I want to come back. Yeah, but you hated me. But you asking me to come back? I must have been good. <laughs> but I ain't going back because you're going to pimp me out. That's right. what you finna do. You finna have me doing everything in the world to try to get that now or so. <laughs> or maybe they're going to know I'm not going to do that. Hmm. You know? But yeah, it's, it's that's what they're saying. They, they, they getting rid of it, you know? They like the Jamba Juice. I think that Jamba Juice is the juice they're going to be giving you the drink that I, uh, I'm sorry about this, you know, but I know we talking now and most people probably don't even know what we talking about now. You know, the <laughs> thing with, you know, you know, the thing what they had you know, on, oh. uh, what, what it was, um, the matrix, the little caskets they was laying in and drinking that juice. That's the jumbo juice. I think CB on TV <laughs> and do everything for you. You mix it up. It looked the same <laughs> like that did. Now they getting you, yeah, full of nutrients and byproducts, and you just lay there and drink you the juice. Like that 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 world, man. Yeah, that's <laughs> what it is. See, <laughs> that? I was just waiting on you to come out with it. It's there you there. go. Yeah, I'm just, you know, I had to throw the rod out there. The, the, I had to throw it out there and get me a little. I had to ring it in a couple of times <laughs> and put it back you out into there. Into the again. metaverse, Mer Dietrich. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Yeah, there you go. Hey man, hey, but I, I I got a couple of land out there. You know, I I, I own I own I, I came up on a couple of the projects that I that I got up under me, man. <laughs> you made some money off of it too, huh? You made some money off of it too. Oh yeah, some of it went up decently, man. Yeah, some big. Some of them went up pretty good. Pretty mm -hmm. good. Yeah, a lot of people, yes, a lot of people don't believe in that metaverse was going on, man. Hey, hey, yeah, because hey. that ain't that's right now. They don't want you to come out the house, right? That's what the the, the point of they don't want us going outside. So the metaverse yeah, is outside. what they're doing. You know, <laughs> the metaverse is taking the place of you going outside. You could put your glasses on and we could go to content Kurt house. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, you we ain't gotta go your, nowhere. You could do your banking in your living room. You can do your Every interviews time. in your living room. <laughs> you go Every to the grocery time. store. Right now, we, we go to the grocery store on the phone. We do our little yep. orders on the phone. But but yep. then you're going to be able to put on the glasses, and you're going to be walking down the aisles, touching things, and, and going into your little <laughs> digital cart. And they're going the drone's going to be just dropping them off at your house. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. It's coming. That's where it's going, man. It's going. It's coming. Yeah, it's yeah. already there, really. Yeah. You know, we got to start updating the people so they yeah. know. Is what you see on TV what's happening, it's already done happen. Right. It ain't like it's coming. Oh, crypto coming. No, this here is in there. It done been in there for some years. They just starting to talk to the masses now. Mm. Yeah. You see? Yeah, we know what's going on, but the masses this is don't. A, this is the information age, man. Right. The information age. A lot of things don't a lot of people don't realize. Like right now, we're going through a lot of people we say reset, we say new world order. But really, just like back, I think it was 1862 when Social Security came on, on the scene, right? Social Security, IRS, whatever, they came on the scene. And then from 1863 to 1877, that's when um, 
They started the reconstruction, the reconstruction phase. So all this is right now basically is another reconstruction, but it's done on a world stage where this is the world reconstruction. There's no longer right. going to be paper money. It's just going to be digital money. You're going to be going through things with your glasses, going to visit these places, doing your shopping. You're going to parties. Everywhere going to be inside the matrix. And believe it or not, folks, a lot of people are going to prefer being in the matrix than being in real life, being in the real world. Because why? Guess what? You put on your glasses. They have, they have, I was telling uh, me and um, Rip Popper Wrinkle Shirt was talking one day and I was telling a man that they have a machine right now. I don't, I don't know if it's uh, Elon Musk or whatever, but they have a machine right now they put on your head and you can actually taste in the metaverse and you can feel, <laughs> you can feel like the wind blowing and you can feel sensation on your skin inside there. Yes. So, so oh, now no, imagine I, I this. Saw that. I saw that. I saw that. Imagine you saw that, right? Imagine yeah. you're you're down in the metaverse, right? And you own this home. You see a nice home. You done got hooked up in the metaverse. You got your land. Now you can experience laying in the bed, swimming in the pool, doing all these things inside your big mansion that you paid. Well, how much you pay for it, Murray? Dietrich? What was that? Pay for what? Which one? Like 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 this place. Uh, let's say you pay like twenty five dollars for this one house, right? Let's say you pay twenty five dollars okay, for this mansion. Huh? Right, yeah. Now you have this big mansion inside there that you're doing everything in it, and you're living it. Yo, you taste your food. You think you're eating food, at least. You think you're drinking wine or moet, you know. But all you got is that stuff that's going, that's being pumped into you while you lay in a box somewhere. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it's really, I mean, it's that's really amazing. Game. That's that's well, amazing, you know, because I went to did no, but that Disney <laughs> Islands, one of them. Wherever the one that got the the avatar ride, right, bro. If they ain't boy, hey, listen to me. I like that's my ride. Yeah. Tears. I shed a tears ride. on that ride. ride. Why? Because that is showing you straight how they messing with your mind. <laughs> that's a mind thing, ain't it? That's a mind how it's flying. I've never been on it. How is it? Hey, bro. Hey, that's that right. That's mine, yeah. bro. You can feel goosebumps because how it go down and how it's flying, bro. That's like you really there. And all you're doing wow. is rocking back and forth in that chair. That's all the yeah. chair doing. <laughs> I'm saying wow. you sitting on it and you can feel right when it's flying and the job and flew a lot, whatever that bird was or whatever, when it stopped for a second, you can feel the heartbeat on your thighs. Because it's tired. Hey, bro, that's the real deal. I went on that about four or five times, man. That I was like, yeah, they messing with your mind on this. This that mind thing. 1882. 62. Okay, that might oh 62. Okay. So that 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 might that was the first like pension plan that came out for jobs. But the right. first like right. for, for social security. Social security right. was that was 1935. 1935. Yeah. Right. The pension, yeah, the pension was in eighteen hundred. Right. Okay, okay, yeah. yeah. That's, that's correct. And, yeah. And hell, we, we might we, we might not even get that when we get there. <laughs> we might yeah. not even get that. Uh, wow. Yeah, Kurt, you told me to re remember something, right? And right. I gotta remember it. All right. You see how we here going through this with the crypto. Right. We in the beginning stages. Right. So pretty much in the beginning stages. It's been going for like 10, 12 years. Right. Something like that. But we're in the beginning stages. Right. What I was saying was it's going to happen with you or without you. So you might as well be a part of it. Okay. You made me remember we could go back to when the world was run off of candles. Like outside, <laughs> you had a candle, street light, even right. the red, the green, and the, and the yellow light had Candles right. in them, right? But when they tried to do the electricity, see this was mm -hmm. where we going at. The electricity was killing people. I'm talking about killing the people, houses burning down, any mean necessary. But it was gonna happen regardless. They didn't care how many people they sacrificed, right? To get where we at today. Today it don't just burn up electricity. House right. ain't just catching on fire. Unless something really done to it. Right. You know, so that's the difference between 
how they did it in the in the past with the electricity. Once they wanted that electricity to change from candle to electricity, that's the same thing from the dollar bill to the digital software to the digital currency. That's the same. Same thing. It's gonna happen regardless. I'm glad I can remember yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, 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 unfortunately though. But when it happened, they got us though, man. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. yeah. But they have been had once, us for a minute too, right? Yeah, but once once that paper money gone, they got you, man. They, everything they got you. They cut it off cut no it more, when they want. Ain't no more cuffing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't no more company. Yeah. But you still yeah. can do little stuff like go get you some gold and silver. You know. Uh, How you gonna trade that though? Yeah, there's somebody out there I'd be able to trade. You'll find <laughs> somebody. Because I was talking to somebody about um silver and gold on the phone. I was at my mechanic. Right. And I was saying, man, ain't no way I could do nothing but no gold or no silver, man. Say, bring it to me, I'd do it. See? <laughs> he had gold and silver. I done been to, a, to the scuba shop with Lexus. We went to the scuba shop up there in Gainesville. My man pulled out his pocket like, you know what that is? I was like, yeah, that's a uh, gold coin. And then I said, you know what crypto is? He was like, oh, you, you know something. Come on back here and talk to me. You see what I'm saying? Right. And people out there got it. But I so, guarantee you somebody come and want to trade with you. Just like Dutra said, like they're going to have you. But if you increase your assets, you know, you start, start yeah. right, it right. Your assets, physical, man. Phys get, get physical stuff. Physical stuff, That's what man. It, is. it has to be tangible. Yeah. You have to be able to touch it to hold it. Yep. Yeah. That's where, that's yeah. where your power is at. So, this is for everybody that's listening. All right. When we, when Dietrich and Rudolph and myself were saying touch things or hold things in your hand, that's your land, your home, yeah. um, jewelry. Um, anything that's physical, not the paper money, because yeah. it's not going to be worth anything, not the coins, nothing like that. And also remember, this is not financial advice. <laughs> do, your, <laughs> do your own research, man. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Back. Now, what, the, the, another plus, though, once they do, I mean, if when we do get to that point, when it's a financial reset, mm -hmm. you know, all, all the debt could be eliminated. Credit cards, home, auto. Why? Because once the, the switch happened, that old debt is no good. And you can't contract the old debt to the new debt. Okay. Everybody who who back and owe it on them credit cards, man. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be Please free, knows. huh? <laughs> that don't mean hey, everybody, that don't mean run up your debt now. That don't mean go out there and start running up your debt. Yeah. Remember, you know? Yeah, but okay, I want to <laughs> ask this. You see how you say the United States and so much debt with China? Right. Does that reset too when the reset set? What you I ain't read that deep into it. That's a good question, though. I, right. I'm, Does I'm that say, reset too? You I'm, see what I'm, I'm saying? Say I don't more know. Than likely no. I'm gonna say no. I gotta look it up, but I'm gonna say no though. Okay. Right. Okay. Because it's, right. Deal, it's right. because it's dealing it's, it's dealing with it. It's dealing with a contract from a from a a government that's not on this land. You know. Mm. So so the, the the contract that they have is still gonna be binding. I, I would assume. Okay. Right. What if now? What if China? They have debt also. If they have what? If they have debt that they owe, like for instance, China owe Europe, or they owe Africa, or they owe someone else. And let's say their debt is up there along with our debt. And they say they're saying on the world currency, everybody is just going to reset. I mean, the China, you don't owe us anymore. We don't owe you. Nobody's owe. Nobody owes anybody. Just make sure you have your gold and the reserves, and you're going to have. You're going to have. Right, that might be no. what you think. No, nah, nah, nah. you don't think nah. so. No, no, because that, that'll move no. the power structure, right? That's like resetting the power structure, and China's not going to give that it, up. It, 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 well, if China got that, to give it up. If, Go ahead, if, Mo. If, if that was if that was the case, that means mm -hmm. China and, and everybody else will have to leave Africa alone, they're not gonna let that happen. China, right. China will have to stop building over in Jamaica and all that shit. They're not gonna stop doing that. Right. America is gonna have to. No, they're not gonna do it. No, this one, gonna now, when it when it comes to the people, they can do it because they they create they create that that they create the the um the monetary you know what I'm saying means for the citizens so they can do that for their people. But I don't think when it comes from country to country, 
that's not nah, hell nah. Because if they do that, that means they're losing money. And they're losing power right. also. They're losing land. I don't think no oh, country no. gonna do that. Nah, they're not doing that. That's true. That's true. That's true. So what what you say they'll lose land? Um how, oh, how yeah. they'll lose the land? Because by clearing the debt. So what country what countries do what in order for a country to like they can't just go just go somewhere and just take it right so what they do is they, they go to the lesser countries and they and they tell them hey we can we can come over here we can build this we can do this and uh we're going to help your people but we're going to charge you for us to do it though right right so so china like so since we were talking about china earth so I, I just want well, to stick with china right so like 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 the um china and pakistan like we were saying there we go with that article <laughs> China is going to go over in Pakistan. They're going to create businesses, right. creating jobs, whatever. But that right. contract is, is is going to be for ninety billion dollars that China is going to have to receive get from Pakistan. So until wow. that debt is paid, right, China is going to be that's their leader. Wow. Right. Oh yeah. Okay. And, but and, it's and a lot of that, those countries with, with with natural with natural material. Right. Nah, all that mining they're doing for gold and oil, they ain't leaving that. Yeah. If America, they're nah, they're, right. anyway. <laughs> they're not going to leave that. <laughs> you're right. They're not going to leave that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Well, what what you were saying, Rue? You had a question you were going to ask. Oh, no, no, no. You, you answered it. You answered it. You okay. answered that. I, I, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking on that. I was just thinking. You know, because now, right now, the United you say we say China is in control and all that, but I think the United States in control. Because okay, I mean, everybody could have their own, they own CBDC, China, Russia, they could have their own. But in order to be in the money system, you got to have the CBDC from Ripple, and Ripple down with the United States, Ripple making everybody jive. So that putting the United States. On top, that's my I mean, speculative thinking. Yeah, I mean, you know, America, they, they still got the muscle now. They're, yeah, they're you know, and, and it's slick. It ain't, it ain't really muscling yes. you. It's slick. We making the CBDCs, bro. You got to get on our rail. Ain't nothing wrong with you having your own. Yeah, you can have your own, but so, <laughs> you got to get on this rail, bro. You know. Wait, hold that's, on, man. So, yes, sir. <laughs> So you said, oh, I gotta, I gotta put that there. <laughs> hey, right, so just say advice. Please do your own research. I'm gonna say it again. Hey, so this said, is but, not financial advice. Please do your own research. Okay, cuz go ahead now. So you saying before we start printing like crazy, we already had the game locked. We got the game on lock. They got to go <laughs> through us. You see, that's what Ripple was doing, making them feel like they was happy. Oh, we gonna leave the United States. And we going over there to another country because they won't go ahead. Ripple know what's going on. It's all. Th it's all. Th at the end of the day, it's all theater, man. It's all together. Yeah. They made it's XRP to do this job. Why would you make something to do that specific job and then change it? It don't, it don't work like that. You made that to do exactly what it's doing. Right. A currency, it cross border payment. <laughs> And they made bit they made Bitcoin go and they said, you know what? Just for just because you took a chance and you invested in the first digital currency, we're gonna reward you. And we're gonna make it shoot up from 20 cents all the way to whatever thousands of dollars. Because it was the first. Yeah, that helped. You know? That was the it billing did. ground. Yeah, that was the that was the reward. And I know like I myself, I'm quite mm. sure you guys had the same thing, had opportunities I, to invest. Hey, I remember that. I remember you hit me up with a hey, hey, Murray boy. Hey, they got something that finna touch a dollar bill. Like, nah, man, ain't nobody finna touch a dollar Remember bill. that? I, okay, oh. yeah, remember I told you Bitcoin, right? Yeah. Man, yes, sir. 2015. Yeah, man. Yeah. Bitcoin, yeah. 2015. We would have been millionaires after that. Today. Oh, we could have been time. broke. We could have been Multi millionaires or broke. They would have been doing this show from yachts, man, from my yachts. <laughs> <laughs> we still going to do it from the yacht. Oh, yeah, it's worry. coming. You just have to claim it, man. Yeah, that's all. It's claimed. <clears throat> yeah, just have to claim mm -hmm. it. That's all. Uh-oh, what's going on? What, 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 uh... Oh, I ain't got but 10% over here, fellas. Yeah. 
Yeah, we gonna rock out now, man. Hey, we're gonna get ready to wrap this show up, man. <laughs> oh, we did an hour, bro. Woo! <laughs> we probably should have broke that down to two, three on. Um. Hey, man, we had Dietrich on. That's our fact check guy. He gonna fact check everything. We gonna yeah. We gonna make sure we keep <laughs> <laughs> we are gonna keep Dietrich on here, man. He gonna keep us up to, up to date on everything, man. Keep us up to date. All right. Yeah, man. You, yeah. you down with that, D? For sure. All right. Hey, Let's we're getting ready it. to end the show, man. Appreciate everybody for watching. You know, myself, I'm Content Kurt. I'm yeah, Papa Ringer shirt. Dietrich. Hey, and we out, man. Till next week. Peace. Peace. Peace.